So I just came across this video here on X and uh, it seems pretty interesting. So let's watch it together. This is Justin Trudeau in Belleville, Ontario, by the way. I mean, there, there's a there's a few people there who are there to see him, but man, that was very, very hostile. The whole crowd chanting, traitor, traitor, and then that dude in the orange shirt just getting, like, right in his face, basically. And you got to be, you gotta be you know, careful. You know, speak your mind, but don't get too aggressive about it. It's not going to do anything except get you in trouble. You have to be loud at the ballot box in October of 2025. That's the best way to really you know, send your message, right? It just really sucks that we have to wait until then. But I mean, this is like another new low for Justin Trudeau. Belleville, Ontario, it's it's not like it's like the most conservative place in the world. You even saw a Trump flag and the F Trudeau flags and people just screaming at him. Like 90, 95% of people there hated him. To think that where we were in 2015 to where we've come now, how much more hostile Canadians are towards you know these politicians. I mean, a lot of them who are going to vote for Pierre Polyev don't even really like him. It's just to get Trudeau out of office because he's so bad. Like everything, it just sucks under Justin Trudeau, especially the cost of living and inflation, which I went over a couple times in past videos. But I mean, this is just getting... <laughs> it's funny, but it's also like... Like, you have to wonder, are the, are the polls, like, usually they're pretty accurate, at least from what I've seen in the past. They're saying that Trudeau's got around 25%. I don't know. I mean, I, I know a few people who like Trudeau, but 25% of the voters, that number might be a little bit off, and he might be underperforming in those polls when the election comes. He might not even get 20%. But, I mean, hey, let, let's be honest, that's, that's up for Canadians to decide how many votes he gets and how many seats he wins. I don't think it's going to be very many. And uh, I know a lot of people are worried, you know, with this whole election interference thing that's going on. Hopefully they get that figured out ASAP and find out who these people are. Um, but I just don't see what Trudeau can... I don't even think a universal basic income can... Because you're just going to have to print more money and then the inflation is going to go up like crazy... I, I, is that even going to help? I used to think it would. I'm not sure anymore. What do you guys think? Do you think, do you think he's going to get, you know, 20% or more in the polls or 20% or less in the polls? Really like hearing uh, from you guys in the comment section. So please don't be shy and don't forget to subscribe, uh, subscribe to this channel. It really helps it grow a lot. And I really do appreciate every one of you who has subscribed. Thanks for watching. And I hope that you have a great day.